concentration. That's not how this is gonna work. 90,000 volts, that's how it's gonna work. Where is she? Hey, Doc. Long time no see. You're looking good. Brother, please don't give Mr. Scipio that instrument. He can't be trusted. He works for Stanton Parish. They don't care who they hurt. Come on, Doc. That any way to talk about an old friend? We used to have something. He has Zoe. What? Lee, you are the reason why he's here. We were safe. <laughs> Doc, come on, I'm, I'm taking that bag. Tracy? I want you to listen to me very carefully, okay? When we're done here, I want you to head over to the edge of the dam, okay? Okay. Get there. You're gonna think you can fly. And you're just gonna step right off. You you can fly, can't you? Yeah. I think so. You might get scared, but I want you to say that it's okay. Just tell yourself, everything is okay. What are you talking about? What came to me in my dream? He said I was special. He told me he's got big plans for me. Wait till you see what's in store already for both of us. She's the one who told me I had a brother. When? Why did you kill our mother? Why and why Dr. Jennings? Because they split us up! They ruined our lives, Andy! We could have been together this whole time. Instead of alone. I, I, couldn't, I couldn't let them do that. I couldn't let them get away with that. No. Maybe it's because he was stealing Dolores' wallet. I was just looking for a pen. In Dolores' wallet? Look, a pterodactyl! Please tell me I didn't just fall for that. Amanda! Uh, uh, really? What is going on? Why don't you ask? Oh. Hey. Oh. She attacked me! He was trying to steal your wallet! Uh, no! No, I wasn't. Have you ever heard the sound of a rib cracking, Brian? It sounds real cool! I stole it, I stole it. Oh. Dolores was trying to do something nice for you and you took advantage oh. of her. Oh. Oh. I'm diabetic. So the hell what? I don't know. May I do the honors, Dolores? Please, but watch the language. Get the F out before I kick your F and A again. Are you okay? Yeah. Uh, apple tea? Uh, apple tea and uh, cranberry juice, please. So, Jasmine, you know what I was expecting. Oh, Rachel said that you wanted to meet someone new. You don't have to be nervous, I'm not gonna buy it. So why do you do this? Why not? You know, it's funny. Back in college, girl like you, wouldn't give me time of day, and now I make you nervous. Hey, no, no, it's a, it's a compliment. Really, I mean, you're, you're very beautiful. That makes you uncomfortable, though, why? I don't know. Well, either you disagree, which means you're very insecure, or... You know it's the truth, but you think it's socially unacceptable to admit it. I, I honestly don't know what to say. I'm just fascinated to know why a woman like you would want to be seen with someone like me. Well, maybe you're the one who's deeply insecure. 
Now we're getting somewhere. So, would you like to see some menus? Hey. <sighs> nice try, bitch. Meg hates the mountains. He's got allergies. <laughs> You kidnapped me? You beat me? You drugged me? And now you're trying to mind rape me? No, I can do this. Just no. She doesn't look very good. Come here. Hey, Doc. I was wondering what it's like to be betrayed by your own daughter. I mean, you sent her to her death, but she was a liar. She was a traitor. She deserved to die, I think. Don't you? Cornell, when you set your family home on fire when you were 15, did you ever wonder what your mother and father and sister felt when they were burning to death? Hmm? Or how your other victims feel when you, uh, how did you put it when we, when we first talked? Can you make their skin sizzle? Drop that, Doc. This is adrenaline. And you know that it triggers your ability. And while your, your hands may be fire resistant, the rest of you is not. You wouldn't. <laughs> 